Hey guys, what's going on? I'm here to show you how to get up and running with your Asus Tinkerboard. It's a micro PC, but I'm pretty sure you already know what it is considering you're watching this video. It's running a flavor of Linux called Debian. It's a very common form of Linux and it is really robust and I'm gonna just get you started so you can get up and running. Now, let's get started by going to the Asus website. You're gonna wanna go to the Tinkerboard specific website and you're gonna wanna go to support and grab the downloads. And this is gonna be the image of the OS for you to install onto your Asus Tinkerboard. For this, you're also gonna need a micro SD card. So once you have your OS image downloaded, you're gonna to have to find a way to mount it to the card. You can't just simply copy paste to it. Now they offer you two things, this etch program, or you can use WinDisk32. I'm gonna use etch for this. So we download etch. Now it's very simple. You plug in the micro SD card, you see it pops up there. And we're gonna go and we're gonna mount our image to the SD card and we're gonna click go. After some time, it's gonna mount the image to the SD card and you will see an error pop up here saying invalid file format. That's fine because that means it actually probably worked. So you can see here, once I click off the error, it says successful, perfect. Now we just take the SD card out, plug it into our Asus Tinkerboard and hit the power button. And if you've done everything correctly, you should see this background. And there you go, you're now up and running. You can customize your Debian OS however you feel like, but this is just how to get you up and running with the Asus Tinkerboard. Guys, thanks so much for tuning in. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.